Hello Internet, welcome to another calculator learning tutorial and in today's tutorial we'll learn how to calculate standard deviation and we'll understand it on Casio FX 100W calculator and I have taken a sample of 7-8 uh, values and uh, we can find summation of x square summation of x we can find out the number of samples and then we can find out standard deviation arithmetic mean we can find out population standard deviation using this calculator but mm, it's a little uh, intricate to know the process the calculations are very simple so we turn the calculator on and we press mode twice then we press 1 for standard deviation then we do shift and SCL and then equal to clear the memory and now we can load uh, the new sample values so let's start entering the values so I enter 55 as my first value and then I'll need to press DT which is right under M plus then I enter 54 I press DT again I enter 51 DT 55 DT 53 DT and then 54 dd 52 dd all right now we'll need to use uh, the recall button along with the alphabets a b and c which are otherwise used in hexadecimal and uh, to find out the desired uh, function for example we find we want to find out uh, summation of squares of values so what we do is recall and a so it is 22 8 of 5 then we do recall of b which is summation of x 427 then we do recall and see to find out how many variables were there we had eight variables um, or other values of data set now we can use shift and the options on one two and three which are um, arithmetic mean population standard deviation and sample standard deviation respectively so i'll press one which gives me arithmetic mean and then I press enter I'm sorry equal so it gives me 53.375 which seems legitimate to me uh, as the arithmetic mean of all my eight different values so I press shift and two to find population standard deviation which is 1.31 alright and then I press shift and 3 which is sample standard deviation which will turn out to be 1.40788 so that is how uh, you can uh, find various uh, things in standard deviation by using recall ABC and shift 1 2 3 all the functions are written here for your reference purpose you can go back to the video and see if you have any doubts and uh, uh, in the next or coming uh, tutorials I'm going to be covering regression and probability functions on all the three calculators 100W, 991ES and 991EX 
so stay tuned and thank you so very much for watching this video you have a very very good day and a good life bye bye